Well, for years, experts thought low levels of vitamin D led to a higher risk of heart attacks, stroke, even heart failure. New research shows that may not be the case after all. KXAN Morning News anchor Sally Hernandez has an in-depth look. Yeah, a number of previous studies found if you have low levels of vitamin D, then you have a higher risk for heart attacks, even heart failure. But here's what you should know. Those were observational studies. There wasn't a clear cause and effect connection. That's according to this new research. So the latest research analyzes 21 clinical studies and found vitamin D supplements had no real benefit to fighting heart disease. The study found no decrease in major cardiovascular events in people taking vitamin D supplements, no drop in heart attack rates, stroke, or death. Now, before this latest research, cardiologists would recommend vitamin D supplements to patients because it was thought to lower their risk of heart disease. But cardiologist Ed Chavezeda of St. David's Medical Center was not entirely convinced. It's a little bit of the story of everybody kind of wants a pill that's going to make them healthy, and I just don't think there's a pill that does everything. And the idea has always been that vitamin D helps with bone health, it helps prevent diabetes, it helps with heart disease. I was always a bit of a skeptic that one thing could help so much. Dr. Shafazeda says he doesn't recommend any supplements to help with heart health, but says things like no smoking, eating healthy, and exercise do help to lower the risk of stroke and heart attack. In the studio, Sally Hernandez, KXAN News. As always, we are committed to helping you learn about your health along with our partner, the American Heart Association. For resources and easy tips to live healthier, just go to KXAN.com and click on Simple Health.